Hello and welcome to the channel that will help you get a focus on your financial well-being, your emotional well-being, and hopefully keep you as cheap and as frugal as possible. Yes, this is the Cheapskate Channel. And today we're going to talk about something more on the lines of health. A few videos ago, I posted a couple of videos uh, concerning the healer named Dr. Sebi. And one I posted was his preparation for his bromide plus preparation, which is sea moss and bladder wag, and mixing it up and making and showing how I prepare the um, how I prepare the preparation. And of course I got some feedback from it. Of course, some people were like, well, no, that's not this, that's not that. You know, I was doing it specifically for the conditions which I have. And I'm a diabetic. I have high blood pressure and a whole host of other things going on with me. And what may work for me doesn't necessarily work for everybody else because I'm not like everybody else and everybody else isn't like me, thank goodness. But, uh, this is more like a six month status report or about six months in me following Dr. Sebi's regime and uh, I'm happy to say I've had a very positive experience in following Dr. Sebi's dietary suggestions uh, in fact I posted one other video where I had fixed some of my foods uh, according to what Dr. Sebi had stated on his website and his uh, talks and what other people who are out there who have cooking channels that also feature similar things that Dr. Sebi advocates. Since Dr. Sebi advocates a vegan type of discipline and a very strict vegan discipline because a certain uh, vegetable plant matter that he says is <clears throat> not natural, it's been man-made or it's been tampered with. And so you really want to try to stick more with the original type of foods out there. And once I got into it, the original type of foods were quite limited, but they're very versatile in how you can take and fix them and really mold them into many things which you are eating every day that are actually unhealthy for you. But you can make a plant-based version of it which is healthy for you and the stuff's delicious you know I I've, I've noticed a decrease in my diabetic symptoms I have a lot more energy you know my eyesight you know once you know I had a lot of mucus build up which kind of clouded my eyesight now remember it was one Dr. Sebi video where he said well he went blind because of it briefly and I can really see where he's coming from on that because I, I lost some eyesight myself in it. Of course, I don't know to the extent he was doing it. And I just am only familiar with my own uh, routine and how I was able to implement his diet plan in the things that I do. But I saw similar things. And yes, he is correct. You do use the restroom a lot. Both ways. Number one and number two. So you have to be mindful of that. But you have to look at it as a way that the body is purging itself of all the things in you that are doing you harm. And so all the discomfort, all the inconvenience that this new way of eating has caused me, I'm looking at the big picture further down the line. Whereas I'm really anticipating a better quality of life, being more healthy, and being able to stick around a little bit longer to stay with my loved ones, my friends, and my family. So, this is what I'm doing, and my six months on this has been pretty good. Uh, I eat 100% plant-based, and I've been doing so for almost six months. And I really don't miss the other things. The only time I kind of miss it is if... Uh, getting plant-based stuff, healthful plant-based stuff is inconvenient and you just can't go everywhere for it even if you go some places and get a salad they want to put all that glop on it 
you know for my salads I only have you know an oil with some herbs and stuff on it maybe a little bit of vinegar in it and uh, I try to add nuts to it you know I used to love pecans but Dr. Sebi seems to have a thing about pecans and where I live I have pecan trees all in my backyard so I can get them for free but I have to watch eating the pecans he likes walnuts and he likes almonds now, I can get those too but you have to watch out for the preparations where the nuts are not raw and they glob a lot of salt on them you know even the salt that you eat you need to eat a sea salt you know there are lots of things that you have to do to really make this thing work otherwise you're spinning your wheels but for the most part I think I've kind of got the hang of it and I'm getting it to work the way I need it need to have it to work because I'm getting results you know I you know I'm, I wasn't very big to begin with but I had a stomach and now my stomach is fading away I have stamina I go you know I, I used to only be able to walk maybe a hundred two hundred feet then I had to stop now I can walk all the way around this little town I live in in fact I'm thinking about getting me a pair of decent running shoes and start to run around the town and I attribute that to Dr. Sebi's diet his dietary suggestions you know, I've seen other people on YouTube who've had positive results for it. In fact, even at Dr. Sebi's retreat in the Honduras, I saw a testimonial video where people had bad situations. And they were saying how Dr. Sebi's diet helped them. In fact, the thing that really pushed me over to really give it a try, they had one gentleman on Dr. Sebi's uh, testimonial vehicle, that <laughs> video, I'm sorry. He was a diabetic. He had symptoms just like I did. And the doctors told him exactly what they told me about the diabetic symptoms. And they hinted at kidney, uh, uh, kidney impairment and all that. And I was going, oh, no. You know, and then they started talking about the possibility of dialysis. And I said, no, 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 no. I, not me. You know, I, I'm not going to do that. I've got to have another way. Because the regular medical system, I know they mean well, but they will help you maintain as you slowly slide down the hill. I'm sorry, I don't think I'm that old. And I know Dr. Sebi, he's in his 80s and he's doing real well. So, And I'm significantly younger than him. So I know I'm not old. And I know there has to be another way. And I'm open to trying other ways. And since... I live in a state where we don't have the Medicare type thing. I did a video on that too where I had the unaffordable affordable health care plan. In states like where I live, like Georgia, the Obamacare is out of the reach. I can't afford Obamacare here because we don't have a Medicare subsidies and I'm too young to get Medicare. Although I had applied for trying for disability because I'm still not. 100% I'm trying this to get out of the hole and I see some improvement but still you know this is not a good state for that so I have to find another way I gotta be all in and try to get healthy because the existing medical establishment is not going to help me at all and I have too much to live for and I have my family my kids my grandkids and I want to see them a long time and I want them to see me a long time and in good health but anyway, this is just a quick status report on my experiences with the Dr. Sebi vegan diet. You know, I'll give other status reports on it and also my experiences on how people react to you about being a vegan. That's a whole nother talk altogether. Some good and some bad. But I'll share that with you next time. If you think this video has been of great help to you and hopefully it's possibly convinced you to try Dr. Sebi's uh, dietary uh, eating habits then please like and share this video and of course as I said in all my videos please copy the web page location at the top of your web page and post that web page location in your LinkedIn Instagram or any other type of social media along with the message that hey check this out this guy was using Dr. Sebi's regime and it's working for him. 
take a look at uh, have them send back to here to hear this report like you have been looking at and look at my other videos and take a look at some of my dishes that I have fixed according to the Dr. Sebi way and look at some of the other folks out here on YouTube and see what they're doing according to Dr. Sebi's theory. This is not a raw, raw, raw video. I'm a big naysayer. And if the stuff isn't working, I'd be the first one on point to say it wasn't working. But this stuff appears to be working for me. So that's the deal, folks. I'm not going to prolong this any longer. It's late when I'm doing this. I just had to, I had the uh, inclination just to get up and give it a try this evening. So thanks for watching and stay tuned to the Cheapskate channel where we hope that we will be helpful in giving you a better quality of life, financially and health-wise. See you next time.